Ms. Ramsey says she is the great, 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 great granddaughter of former North Carolina Governor John Motley Moorhead. Like her ancestor, she is serving the people of North Carolina. Laid off from her job as a pre-K teacher, Beverly Ramsey says she turned to her sewing skills, producing masks for family and friends. The masks were so popular, Beverly decided to produce more and share them with neighbors in Greensboro's Sunset Hills community. And I'm like, now how am I going to get these two people who need them without like you know, being face to face with them because you the social distancing part was, you know, that was part of it. The answer was right outside her door. She started taping the mask to a tree. She says the first batch disappeared in no time. And I was like, whoa, well, that was pretty cool. And the first day I didn't sit outside. I stayed inside because I didn't want people to feel self-conscious about, oh, that's weird. There's a face mask tree. You know, so I just, I left it alone. But as the weeks went by, Beverly Ramsey changed her approach. I met people and talk to people that I've lived among for a couple of years that I had no idea how amazing they are. There were concert pianists who are known all over the world that came by and got some masks. The mask maker of Sunset Hills says she now produces 250 face coverings a week. She has help her 80-year-old mother. She irons and she clips the strings and she puts in the pens. <laughs> That's what she allows me to do. And she uses my sewing machine. <laughs> Mother and daughter make masks for nonprofit groups as well, helping immigrants and pregnant women stay safe. And it all started at a tree outside her home. As I say, the tree is blooming. Well, so the tree has truly bloomed. I've got to ask you how you feel about all this and what it's done, you think, for yourself. I feel very blessed. Really, whatever I'm putting into this, I get back tenfold. Um, I get the assurance that no matter how dark things look, you know, when you look out at the nation and all these terrible things going on, that people as a whole are good. You know, we have a kindness in us. We have a goodness. And we're going to work together to make sure we're all okay. Beverly Ramsey says she has produced somewhere between two and 3,000 masks so far. She says she's gotten a little bit of flack on social media. She says she has ignored those comments. She says that masks are a health issue, not a political one. In Greensboro, I'm Bill O'Neill. WXII 12 News. <laughs>